Welcome, everyone. Welcome to the Flame of Love of the Immaculate Heart of Mary program here on Radio Maria USA. My name is Jill Metz. I'm the U.S. National Director for the Flame of Love, and I'm here today with Yvonne Duffy, the Regional Coordinator for the entire West. So welcome, Yvonne. Thank you for joining today to um, share just about the Flame of Love, but also about the incredible conference we have coming up just next week. Thank you. Thank you, Jill, for inviting me. It's a pleasure to be here and to address all the listeners out there and all the devotees to the Flame of Love. Welcome. We're happy you're here with us and that you'll be listening to our show today. Thank you. I, can we go ahead just for the sake of um, uh, sharing the beautiful prayers of the Flame of Love and for um, really protecting our program today and all those who are listening. And we'll start by praying the meditation of the five wounds of Jesus. So Beautiful. would you yeah. like to start that, Yvonne? No, I'd love to. Thank you. All right. Let's gather ourselves in a moment of prayer. And we offer ourselves to the Heavenly Father through all the wounds of our Savior, Jesus Christ. We kiss the wound of your sacred left hand, Lord, with sorrow deep and true. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. And we kiss the wounds of your sacred right hand with sorrow deep and true. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. We kiss the wound of your sacred left foot with sorrow deep and true. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. We kiss the wound of your sacred right foot with sorrow deep and true. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. And we kiss the wound of your sacred side with sorrow deep and true. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. And now we'll pray together the unity prayer. My adorable Jesus, May our feet journey together. May our hands gather in unity. May our hearts beat in unison. May our souls be in harmony. May our thoughts be as one. May our ears listen to the silence together. May our glances profoundly penetrate each other. And may our lips pray together to gain mercy from the Eternal Father. Amen. O oh, Blessed Lady, spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. So Yvonne, we have an incredible, incredible event. We were just talking about it before the recording um, in one week. Um, in Alto Loma, California, with an incredible lineup of speakers. And for the first time, we will have an appointment of our uh, a new regional Hispanic directors um, for the entire um, West. So this is very exciting, a very momentous moment for us in the movement. But I thought it'd be great if you could share just a couple of um, things about our speakers. Oh, certainly. So we have a wonderful list of priests coming to speak. Um, we're going to be having Father Hyacinth Ibe, and he's a wonderful Nigerian priest who's filled with the love of God and also of our Blessed Mother, very devoted. Whenever there is something that Our Lady wants, he wants it 200%, he told me. <laughs> so he's very much filled with love for Our Lady and, of course, for the cause of the flame of love. And he's very active in spreading the flame of love in his parish. He actually has the unity prayer said after every single mass, daily mass, weekend masses. So he's just on fire with love for God and Our Lady. And we also have Father Michael Berry coming. He's going to be presenting a talk and he'll be helping with the closing mass and also the healing service. Father Berry is very anointed with the Holy Spirit. And he's going to be sharing his special gifts with us during that time of praying over all the people at the end of the conference. So we're really blessed to be able to have Father Barry with us. 
Um, also, Father Charbel will be attending. He's a Norbertine priest from St. Michael's Abbey, and he's very well known, especially in the Spanish-speaking community. He gives talks, and I believe he has a radio show on the Spanish station. So we're also blessed to have Father Charbel with us. Um, additionally, there'll be Father Ed Broom. He is an oblate with the Blessed Virgin Mary. And he also is very active in the Ignatian exercises. He leads many, many, many retreats. He's spiritual director to just so many souls. And he guides and leads us closer into the heart of God through the Blessed Mother, mm. which is what the Flame of Love is really all about. Marian and Eucharistic, through Our Lady to the heart of Jesus. And then we have Father Robert Elias Barcelos, who is a wonderful Carmelite priest. He was just overnight ignited in the flame of love. And since then, he has been preaching and supporting Our Lady's cause. He understands well about the transforming and illuminating grace of the flame of love. And he's just a dynamic speaker, a wonderful, powerful presence. And we are just overwhelmed that he's going to be able to join us for both talks, confession, times of adoration, and he'll be the main celebrant for the closing mass. Um, so, oh, and also we'll have a video presentation with Father Jorge Reyes, who is the Assistant International Coordinator from the Flame of Love. And he's going to be presenting a message via a videotape. So he is very much, his heart is there. He wasn't able to be there present, but his heart is very much um, wanting to support this conference and speak to all of the attendees there. So it should be just a wonderful conference, powerful presence of priests and lay speakers alike. Um, yourself, Jill, will be there and John Sullivan, our international coordinator, will also be present giving talks and he'll speak on his worldview of how the flame of love is moving throughout the earth. So we're very blessed for that. And then we also have a presentation by Mike and Susie Scanlon Smith, who will be talking about how their daughter was transformed through love. And that's going to be a really incredible talk, um, just about the story of their daughter, who was just so desirous that everyone adore our Lord in the Blessed Sacrament. So we're very excited for all these different speakers and our time that we're going to spend together in prayer and worship of God. Amen. That's an, that's amazing. And especially having testimonials, not only from this young lady, but from priests themselves of how the flame of love has impacted their life. I just cannot wait. I'm looking forward to being with everyone for your team. And I want to personally thank you for the incredible work that you have um, poured into this, which we know always requires a lot of sacrifice, um, prayer and time. So thank you, Yvonne. I'd like to dive in if we could to the theme of our national conferences. Um, for our listeners, we ha have been growing in such a way that um, just having one national conference um, became a challenge for us. And so this year, for the first time, we've had three regional national conferences. This West Conference will be our last um, for the year, and we will kick off 2025 in the South um, in April for the spring. So we're looking forward to that. But for the theme this year, we had our conference um, titled The Flame of Love is Marian and Eucharistic. So I thought it'd be great, Yvonne, if we could just take, you know, 15 minutes here this morning and dive in a little bit um, uh, to the spiritual diary, into the diary to find out what does that mean? The flame of love, <clears throat> excuse me, is Marian and Eucharistic. So we know that the flame of love of the Immaculate Heart of Mary is for every single soul on this planet. It's for all of humanity. But in, gen in, in particular, God ignited the flame of love into one soul to begin this great gift of grace across all of humanity. And he ignited it into the soul of Elizabeth Kendelman, a Hungarian lay Carmelite um, Catholic woman who um, was the first to receive this great grace. And Mary, in the spiritual diary to Elizabeth Kendelman, told her, you have to seek a refuge for my flame of love, which is Jesus Christ himself. And this message is really for all of us, all of us 
we want to share this flame of love with. Um, so we felt that the Holy Spirit chose this year's conference stream to not only support the National Eucharistic Revival that was absolutely incredible this year that we know is still going on, but to also bring us all closer, Catholics and non-Catholics, to his Eucharistic love, which we see every time we look at the Holy Crucifix. The unity prayer is completely Eucharistic because not only does it blind Satan, but it also aligns and, uh, and, and unites our will. Really, it unites our will to the will of God as we accompany Jesus to the road of Calvary. So, Yvonne, on page 42 of the Spiritual Diary, would you um, read the first time that we hear about the unity prayer? Certainly. So Jesus is speaking to Elizabeth Kindleman, and he's revealing to her this magnanimous prayer that has such power and such force in it that it not only blinds Satan, but by the true outpouring fullness of love, it unites us into the love and the light of God blinds Satan and the Amen. darkness Amen. is taken away. So in, on page 42, it says, Elizabeth Kennelman, then the sweet redeemer asked me to pray with him the prayer that expresses his deepest desire. And then we have the unity prayer present. May our feet journey together. May our hands gather in unity. May our hearts beat in unison. May our souls be in harmony. May our thoughts be as one. May our ears listen to the silence together. May our glances profoundly penetrate each other. And may our lips pray together to gain mercy from the eternal Father. Amen. And Elizabeth says, I made this prayer completely mine. The Lord meditated on it many times with me, asserting that these are his ex eternal longings. He taught me this prayer so that I would, in turn, teach it to others. With all our strength in mind, let us make our own eternal, his eternal thoughts and burning desires. And afterward, after giving her the prayer, the Savior added, This prayer is an instrument in your hands. By collaborating with me, Satan will be blinded by it. And because of his blindness, souls will not be led into sin. Beautiful. And so I think it's important to touch on, you know, what is the unity prayer? What is Jesus asking in this unity prayer? And he's made it clear that he's expressing his deepest desires to us in the unity prayer, which is to be one with us, to be totally um, enmeshed into one heart. And so what this means when we are, when we become one with God, one with Jesus, Satan is blinded. So we also read in the spiritual diary another thing that blinds Satan, and that's the Holy Mass. Um, when we receive Jesus in a state of grace, Satan is blinded. And so it says um, in the diary on November 22nd, 1962, if you attend Holy Mass while under no obligation to do so, and, of course, you are in a state of grace before God. During that time, I will pour out the flame of love of my heart and blind Satan. My graces will flow abundantly to the souls from whom you offer the Holy Mass. Participation in the Holy Mass is what helps the most to blind Satan. So, our Lord has made a way not only now for Catholics, you know, to participate in the fullness and the source and summit of our entire faith, which is to receive Jesus in the blessed sacrament, where his blood flows with our blood. This is, I'm a convert to the faith, and this is the sole reason why I became a Catholic. Well, the sole reason for the flame of love is to blind Satan. This is the sole purpose of this great miracle this great gift of grace for all mankind. 
So the reason why we chose this incredible theme that the flame of love is Eucharistic in Marian is because we understand that the flame of love first came to save us through Our Lady's beautiful and holy womb. Right? He came to us as a savior from Our Lady. Um, and now he comes again through her immaculate heart. We are receiving Jesus, not just as Catholics, but as for the whole world, we get to receive him in this gift of the flame of love given to us from Our Lady. So uh, the, the theme, did you have any comments about that, Yvonne? Well, that was just so beautiful how you said that, that when Jesus became incarnate, he came to us through the womb of Our Lady full of grace. And in the flame of love, he comes to us through her immaculate heart, that pure vessel full of love. She has the fullness of God's love within her immaculate heart. And he's coming to us in a new way to do new things, to create new beginnings in us, to create a new world. And it's all coming through Our Lady's immaculate heart. We need to really um, go to Jesus through Our Lady, and that is powerful. And that explains uh, the theme for our conference, that the flame of love is both Marian and Eucharistic. We go to Our Lady to receive our Lord, who then empowers us by his presence in us, his light in us, that diffuses all darkness. It is such a beautiful message of hope um, in this time when we're in a lot of darkness, and it's for everyone, just like you said, for anyone to grab hold of this. Um, Catholic, non-Catholic, she said it's even the unbaptized are going to feel the effects of the flame of love grace. So this is a just tremendous outpouring of love of God, mercy of God, and presence of God in our lives. Amen. Beautiful. Thank you for um, offering that. I thought we could look at page 186 of the Spiritual Diary now together. Um, for all of you at home that have the diary, this is again found on page um, 186. And we will read it here for those that are listening. And it says, um, th this diary quote is, they must be fervent at holy communion. And it, Jesus says to Elizabeth, I give myself. After receiving my precious blood, examine your souls and become aware of the exhilaration that the power of my precious blood brings about in you. Do not be so insensitive. Let not routine lead you to my holy table. To the degree that you remain united to me, my precious blood will burn sin out of your souls. Jesus's precious blood must permeate their souls. During Holy Com Mass and after Holy Communion, the Lord Jesus spoke of the press power of his precious blood. And this is what he said. I am the great donor of blood. By virtue of my divine blood, you can be divinized. Can you understand that? Truly, it is difficult. I am the sole donor of blood in the whole world. Permeate yourself with my love, my almighty love. Meditate on that now in the light of my holy brightness. Can't you feel this precious blood? My precious blood warms up and sets into motion the frozen, paralyzed energy of your souls. And Jesus promised that their effects would save millions. Your faith and trust will give strength to a million souls to persevere. Unite yourself to those souls that are consecrated to me. I call you also. So do you have any thoughts? <laughs> I'll let you uh, start, Yvonne. Okay, that is just so deep and there's so many elements to it, but... We know that it's only through the precious blood of our Lord that we can come into unity with God. It was because of the sacrifice that he made, the pouring out of his precious blood completely to the last drop that covers us, that purifies us and cleanses us so that we are worthy, made worthy by his redemptive act to come into unity with God, to fulfill his deepest desire 
of being in unity with God. And I love in this um, passage that you read how Jesus explains that at times we are frozen, we are paralyzed. We have an energy within us that sometimes just is blocked and we can't live that energy that he wants us to live. And by the power of his precious blood, it sets us free. That's what the flame of love does. It just it just removes all of the fear and all of the despair, and it gives us a new life, a new beginning, a new energy. That's the new wine that we need poured into our hearts now so that we can be active in working with him um, and his blessed mother for the salvation of souls, that we can invoke the power of the flame of love to blind Satan, to help to save our family members, to help to strengthen our marriages, to bring back our children, and to just affect every person he allows us to encounter during our life's journey each day, using the means that he gives us in our ordinary lives. And it's through the power of this precious blood that we most um, highly experience in Holy Communion. That's when his, he says, think about my blood and the exhilaration that it causes within your soul. And that is the energy and the power that we want our lives to have. And, and it just spills over in joy. Um, and we need a lot of joy now. Amen. So it's <laughs> beautiful. This passage gives us so much to meditate and to really receive. I love that. And I love, love when in this, in this particular um, diary entry, it says, I am the sole donor of blood in the whole world. It's Jesus's blood who is the soul. His drop of blood could save the whole world, one single drop. In fact, in the spiritual diary, it says that Jesus would die a thousand times for just one soul. He would go through the crucifixion. He would go through the agony in the garden. He would go through the scourging. He would do it all again for just one soul. And so, through Our Lady's love, she has made a way for all of us, all of humanity, to receive this outpouring of love. And it's through the flame of love of the Immaculate Heart of Mary. This love is what blinds Satan. This is what gives us exactly what Yvonne said, exactly what the, this new energy, this new wine. And so not only do we need a revival just in the Catholic Church, just in the Eucharist, a, a Eucharistic revival. We need a revival um, in all of the sacraments. This flame of love of the Immaculate Heart of Mary is what um, it, it ignites this revival. And, and not only does it ignite the revival, it brings about Our Lady's triumph of her Immaculate Heart. And so... Um, in closing, we have about 50 seconds, Yvonne, <laughs> right when we're getting warmed up. Um, but I think that um, what I'd like to end with is that um, to blind Satan means to render him powerless, right? So we must surrender. He must surrender the hold that he has over our lives when he's blinded. He has to let go. Not only does he have to let go of um, the stronghold he has over our personal lives when we receive the flame of love, but Our Lady promises that this is extended into our homes and into our family. And so we want to personally invite you, all of those that are in the West, if you can get a ticket to this conference on October 18th and 19th, please come join us receive the flame of love signal grace for yourself for your family and ultimately for the whole world yvonne anything else before we close that was a beautiful invitation i extend that same invitation just make the time attend the conference receive the flame of love be strengthened in the grace and it'll just It'll just transform your life and the lives of those around you. 
So thank you. Thank you, Yvonne, for sharing always just your profound and beautiful thoughts. I look forward to seeing you and everyone that's watching and listening on again, October 18th and 19th, the Flame of Love National Conference in the West. We hope to see you there to ignite the flame of love in your hearts. God bless you all. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day He rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From thence he shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. For faith, hope, and charity. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The First Sorrowful Mystery The Agony in the Garden Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace 
of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The second sorrowful mystery, the scourging at the pillar. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, 
now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The Third Sorrowful Mystery, The Crowning with Thorns Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The fourth sorrowful mystery, the carrying of the cross. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The fifth sorrowful mystery, the crucifixion and death of our Lord Jesus Christ. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all of humanity, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To Thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To Thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious Advocate, thine eyes of mercy toward us. 
and after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, grant we beseech thee that while meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise. Through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Remember, O most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to thy protection, implored thy help, or sought thy intercession, was left unaided. Inspired by this confidence, I fly unto thee, O Virgin of virgins and my mother. To thee I come, before thee I stand, sinful and sorrowful. O Mother of the Word incarnate, despise not my petitions, but in thy mercy hear and answer me. Amen. Saint Michael, the Archangel, defend us in battle. Be our defense against the wickedness and the snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray, and do thou, O Prince of the heavenly hosts, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the evil spirits, who prowl about the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Most sacred heart of Jesus, have mercy on us. Most sacred heart of Jesus, have mercy on us. Most sacred heart of Jesus, have mercy on us. My adorable Jesus, may our feet journey together. May our hands gather in unity. May our hearts beat in unison. May our souls be in harmony. May our thoughts be as one. May our ears listen to the silence together. May our glances profoundly penetrate each other. May our lips pray together to gain mercy from the Eternal Father. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen.